Good morning, so I am going to film a what I eat in a day in a deficit today so I will take you along with me and we'll just see what happens but yeah basically I have been trying to film this video for a few days now but my camera has kind of a glitch I do not know what happened but I am here trying to film it again and it does look like it's working at the moment so I will just take you along with me to have breakfast I am going to be working today as well so I do not have a lot of time to do like my morning routine and everything like that I already did like wash my face and did all that stuff but like for my morning I usually make breakfast and then work out but since I'm working till one o'clock I will just work out after that and just do all the things that I have to do. So as a protein powder, I'm gonna be using this one here. Even though it's not supposed to be a real protein powder, it's just supposed to be like protein hot chocolate, but I love the taste. So I'm just using this one as a protein powder and using a bit of a bigger serving size because otherwise it does not have enough protein in it, for my liking at least. And I love that it's just one kilo of protein powder and it's not even that expensive. I did get it off sale last time I bought it, so I got two of them. But yeah, I really love it and I'm gonna be using it for my smoothie today. So I finished preparing my breakfast, so I'm just gonna eat my avocado toast in my smoothie. So that's gonna be everything that I have today and I'll just basically catch up with you at lunch. So I'm just back from work now and basically since I have this for lunch, which my grandma made, it's called parmigiana it's italian so that's what i'm gonna be having for lunch and since it's already already i will actually first make my dessert because i'm gonna be making cookies and i want them to be ready when i'm done eating so i'm going to be making these ones first and then i'll just eat the parmigiana when i'm done basically so yeah, I'll just get right started with the cookies. I'm so excited and I will just show you how I make them. These ones are amazing, I've tried them before. So we'll just do them together. <laughs> I just wanted to show you my cookies that I made again and oh they're not staying <laughs> on the plate but anyways I just wanted to tell you that I had three of those cookies and then a few pieces of that parmigiana and yeah that was my lunch basically and I'm probably gonna have cookies as a dessert for dinner again but we'll see what i have because my mom's gonna make dinner <laughs> so while i prepare my pre-workout drink i'm just going to talk to you so basically this is the pre-workout that i'm using it's from naked harvest it's already my second bottle of it so i really love it but it goes so quickly because i use it so much but anyways i basically just wanted to tell you that i'm about to work out i just wanted to also talk about everything that i've been doing and just because i've already done this before I've already been in a deficit and i'm doing it for the second time so basically i will just keep you updated throughout my progress it's gonna be about three months 
so 12 weeks of me being in a deficit so you will get updates and all of that so stay tuned if you're interested to see how my journey evolves and subscribe if you're interested to see more i guess i just wanted to say that today i am training lower body which i'm very excited for i have to hurry a bit because my mom wants to work out as well and we have a home gym and if i'm filming there should not be any people there as well but I am very excited to be showing you my pre-workout drink. So I just filled it up with a bit of water and I just have to shake it a bit. Basically, if you're interested, just let me know if you want to know more about this, have more content about my deficit and everything that I'm doing, or also if you want me to talk about my deficit that I've already done. I have tons of videos on that already which I will link the playlist in the description box and also up here. But if you have any more specific questions or anything like that, just let me know and I will for sure make a video on that because I know how hard it is to get started with your health journey and all of that without becoming obsessive or just going in a wrong direction or even not doing anything even though you think you're really trying hard. Yeah, basically. This is my pre-workout, like I said, oh, it's strawberry flavored. I really like this. I have not tried the other flavors, so if you know if there's another, like, better one, let me know for sure, because I don't, I don't know. If I like something, sometimes I have to be in a specific mood to try something new if I know that something is already amazing, because I don't want to be disappointed, but Anyways, if you know the other flavors and can tell me that they are good as well, let me know because this one is my favorite, but I've only tried this one. <laughs> so I would love to try other ones if you can recommend them to me. But I will stop talking now and I will go and work out. So your tears been running like a waterfall Thought the stars would never let you down And you keep on thinking you could save yourself But that's love, that's just love You should know some things will hurt So I just finished my workout and took a shower. My hair is still wet because we're gonna have dinner really soon and I actually want to try and not use as much heat on my hair anymore because I've been using way too much heat on my hair for like years. So I just wanted to try something new. Anyways, I just wanted to tell you what we're gonna have tonight because my mom's cooking and Basically, I saw that we're having a salad and also fries with like fish nuggets or something like that. But I will show you like my whole plate and everything for tonight as well. But basically, I wanted to talk about how many calories I'm actually consuming at the moment while I'm in a deficit. To be clear, I am eating 1,700 calories right now and that is my deficit, which means that my maintenance would be at around 2,200 calories. So I did already do this about six months ago and I had my deficit, I did that, lost 7 kilos and then did my reverse diet. Over the summer I did not try to lose weight at all, I just tried to maintain my weight even though I did gain a little bit of weight but I'm completely not worried about that. I will go right into my deficit now and just continue my journey as I had planned and yeah basically I'll just take you along with me on this journey. So right now it's September and this is the first week of me doing my deficit so I'm right at the start. If you want to know everything real time I will be doing this till about December which is three months and yeah basically I will have 
videos and all of that documenting my journey so be here real time and subscribe so that you don't miss a video and if you're here from the future i will have all of those videos somewhere in a playlist link down below i just wanted to announce that i'm doing this deficit so that you can join me or just see how everything works and how everything goes but it's not quite over yet because i will still show you my dinner for today just about to start reading my book on my balcony and basically I realized that it's okay this just fell but basically I realized that it's just starting to rain and well I think that if it's not too bad like if it doesn't get worse I can still be out here for a bit but I just love reading out here for the evening. You will have seen my dinner with my family and everything, so I did have everything. I also had my cookie and all of that, so yeah. I'm just going to stay on the balcony for a little while longer and I think I'm gonna sign off here. And I just wanted to say that I really hope you enjoyed this video, if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you like seeing those videos and i hope i see you in my next video bye